Hi, this is Intrinsic, and if you're looking for ways to make learning fun and motivating from within your child, then you've come to the right place. I'm Nina, and today I'm going to tell you about a game called Engineering Ants. Today, the game my daughter wanted to play was Engineering Ants. If you've watched any of my other videos, you won't be surprised to know that my daughter wanted to play this line guard style, which means that she takes her toy figures and we play it with this game. It makes it more fun for her and I'm okay with that. So as you watch this and you're seeing us move those pieces, don't be confused. The normal game uses an ant and ant eater as the pieces. Engineering Ants is a cooperative game where you are saving your fellow ants from the ant eater. There are places on the board where obstacles are, three places they are face up, and three places they are face down. If they're face up, then you cannot pass them without engineering a solution to get past them. If the obstacle is face down and you don't land on it, you don't have to do anything. But if you land on it, then you turn it over and you have to engineer a solution for that as well. Engineering Ants has a variety of cardboard and plastic pieces that you put together to represent a solution to get past an obstacle. The die has an ant and it has numbers. If you roll a number, then you go that many spaces. If you roll an anteater, then the anteater gets closer to the anthill. If the anteater gets to the anthill before you save the three ants, the anteater wins. If you beat the anteater, your team wins. Engineering Ants is so cool. It's a fun game. You move these two ants around the board and to save these, these, these ones. When you roll the die, you have to be careful not to, not to land on this. Not to land on anteater. It, if that happens, it goes closer to the ant hill. And there are obstacle cards, which does lots of things like, like, like this, like this one. Angry Bear and this one. Quick sand pit. There's a lot of obstacles. How you get past them is you use stuff like this. Different ones solve different problems. This is a fun game. We really enjoyed playing this game. It promotes creative thinking, problem solving, and engineering skills. If you're looking for more resources that are fun, engaging, and promote other skills, check my link below. I have a list of all the resources categorized in different subjects. If you found this video helpful, subscribe to Intrinsic, because meaningful learning is driven by desire from within.